Okay, so it's currently half time in the Burnley uh, Manchester United game. It's currently nil nil. Uh, I want to change up the way I do these videos because um, it ha it happens too often where at the end of the game I'll do these videos and I I'll have forgotten something important that happened in the video and that happened in the game. And I'll be editing this video afterwards. I'll be editing the video afterwards, and uh, it. I'll just be like, oh, for God's sake, uh, how did I forget that or something? Um, so anyway, my thoughts on the first half of the game are that um, Burnley, I, I, th I think, can win this. Uh, the the way they're breaking up the game, they're not a, not allowing Man United to. Uh, get a solid uh, passing passing um, move going, like they're they're just committing tactical fouls, pumping the ball long, and getting Chris Wood and Ashley Barnes to head it down for each other and take a shot. And there was a five minute VAR controversy where uh, Luke Shaw put in a he he got a little bit of the ball. Um, but he went through, lunged in with his uh, studs up. And to me, I, I felt it could have been a red card, but I don't want to say it was a red card. It's one of them where you wouldn't argue if the ref did give a red card, but you're not going to... It's 50-50 between a yellow and a red. Luke Shaw got fortunate and got a yellow. Uh, and then once that tackle happened, the ball instantly got hit up to the other side of the pitch. Uh, Ed Edinson Cavani um, had the ball. He was through on goal. And Robbie Brady uh, just put in a... It was a horrendous tackle, let's be honest. It, it wasn't like dangerous to the player, but he completely missed the ball. And um, he, he, he did take out a bit of Cavani and um, it was a foul and R R Robbie Brady was initially given a yellow card but obviously because of Luke Shaw's foul at the off hand um, VAR sorted it out and uh, gave the free kick to Burnley like they should have done so that it was well done by VAR but the fact that it took five minutes was ridiculous like it's getting to the point now where like in in the VAR room, they just go. They'll be looking at it for two minutes, and the conclusion they come to is, yeah, just sack it off, give it to the referee. Like, what's the point in them looking at it for two minutes for them to just go, oh, uh, Kevin Friends, come and have a come and have a look at this. Come on, you're you're going to make the decision. We we we'll, we'll get back to Fortnite. <laughs> um, it, it, it is ridiculous, and uh, they they need to, like two minutes, two minutes. If it's a big, big game uh, decision, I, I can deal with two minutes. It taking two minutes to make a big decision, but five minutes is ridiculous. Anyway, uh, I will see you at the end of the second half. However, before that, I completely forgot to mention that uh, Harry Maguire uh, had a goal dislike, didn't he? I forgot to mention that. Um, the second half is just starting now. Um, <clears throat> uh, it was a, it was the ball was crossed in. I think it was Luke Shaw who crossed it in. Harry Maguire's coming through the back post, and Eric Peters is sort of just about jumped to head it, and Harry Maguire's put his hand down on Eric Peters and prevented him from jumping. Uh, it was a very good head by Harry Maguire actually. It's a shame he did foul the defender, um, but uh, yeah, it, it was definitely a foul. Anyway, hopefully this time I haven't forgotten anything. I'll see you in, at the end of the second half. Manchester United have won one nil and have overtaken Liverpool in the table going first. Right, uh, so the second half. Uh, Edinson Cavani had a couple of really good chances which he 100% should have scored. Uh, the the first one it it was almost like a tap in almost he just he had a lot of got the goal to aim a lot of the goal to aim at 
And for a player of his quality, you certainly expect him to score it. Hang on, the camera's off here. Yeah, you certainly expect him to score it. And uh, the second goal, the, the second chance, uh, he didn't even put it on target. You, I, I get that a lot of the, there's a lot of Burnley players in front of you, but he's still he's only ten yards away from the goal. You gotta get that on target at least to have any chance of scoring. Uh, but anyway, the goal, Paul Pogba, it was a, a brilliant connection on the volley. Um, it, it was actually going into the bottom corner, which would make the goal look even more impressive. Uh, but it did take a small deflection off uh, Matthew Lawson. And unfortunately for Burnley, it went straight through Pope's legs as he was diving. Uh, it was a very tight hole for it to go through. <laughs> That's what she said. Uh, yeah. Right. Um, anyway, uh, as as the game uh, finished, um, United did did unfortunately pick up a few injuries. Uh, it's Anthony Martial uh, hamstring injury, which doesn't look good for Sunday. He he would be starting on Sunday. You would you would have thought, uh, but it looks like Mason Greenwood might have to now. Oh, I can't wait for Sunday. <laughs> Anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.